Hi, it's Dwyer, gamblersadvisory.com, DwyerSportsBetting.com. Remember, the opinion you should follow should be your own. Just consider this video to be a second opinion from a complete stranger online. Many teams are looking for coaches, including the New York Jets. Right? If you're a fan of the NFL, if you like to figure out which coach is going to go where, I'm going to boldly I'm going to boldly predict here. Um, early in the morning on January the 2nd, 2015, that the Jets' next head coach is likely to be Doug Marone. Right? Understand the way the world really works. Rex Ryan and Doug Marone share the same agent. If there's anyone who knows what was in the contracts of these coaches, it would be the agent who helped them negotiate the terms. Right? So, understand. Rex Ryan, who cleared out his office before the last game of the season, no doubt knew that he was on the way out. Doug Marone had a contract that gave him an out after this season if he wanted it. Right? His agent, the same agent as Rex Ryan, would know that. So, you can imagine, when Rex Ryan found out that he was out at Jet as Jet's head coach, let's just say that Doug Marone's agent, I'm sure, also received that information. Understand, too, that Kyle Orton, Buffalo's quarterback, announced his retirement after the season. It was Doug Marone and his staff that decided to go to Kyle Orton after watching supposed quarterback of the future in Buffalo, E.J. Manuel, look less than exemplary. Right? So, Doug Marone already had moved away from E.J. Manuel, and the quarterback he picked to lead the team was out. Understand, too, they had an ownership change in Buffalo, right? A new group owns the Buffalo Bills. That's why Doug Marone's opt-out clause was able to be triggered, because that opt-out clause was available to him if, uh, if Buffalo had a change of ownership, right? Ralph Wilson, the beloved prior owner of the Buffalo Bills, passed. And so you had an ownership transition giving Marone the opportunity to leave the team, while, of course, getting paid to do so without an offset. Right? I would encourage you to read further on that. Well, here's the point. If you're the Jets, you're crazy to hire anyone else. The Buffalo Bills just beat up on the New England Patriots the last week of the season. In two seasons with Buffalo, Doug Marone has greatly improved that team. Who knows the players in the division better than a guy who is in the division? Right? Understand, Buffalo had one of the best defenses in football, not just the AFC. So if I'm the Jets, as I interview Frank Reich and others, right, understand that I have a guy who is from New York City, Doug Marone grew up in the Bronx, who used to be a member of the Jet coaching staff, which Doug Marone was for years, right, who's one of the better coaches in the National Football League. And, of course, you know Doug's agent because he's the same agent for the last coach you had. I think it's a no-brainer. I'll be very surprised if the Jets don't pick Doug Marone, right? When a 
guy in your division who's one of the better coaches, who was not fired, who opted out of his deal, who vastly improved his team in two years, who already has a dossier on how to beat the New England Patriots, on how to cope with the Miami Dolphins, who's already acclimated to playing these teams twice during the season. When a guy like that becomes available, in my opinion, especially when you have a history with the guy, and the guy's from your city, and you know his agent, in my opinion, you take him. So I'll be very surprised if Doug Marone is not the choice here. I'm guessing Doug Marone exercised his opt-out clause with an eye on possibly getting the Jet job. Right? Even though a lot of the names being bandied about are more high-profile than Doug Marone's, I'd be surprised if the Jets find a better coaching candidate. I think Doug Marone ends up as the next head coach of the New York Jets. To Jet Nation, to Jet Nation let me hear from you. Who would you like to see wearing the green and white? Who do you expect to see as the next head coach of the New York Jets? From where I sit, I think the answer to that question is Doug Marone. Let me hear from you. Thanks for stopping by.